Hi, I'm Carolyn Marie Wright. My first monologue is Olivia from Twelfth Night, and my second is Imogen from Cymbeline. What is your parentage? Above my fortunes, yet my state is well. I am a gentleman. I'll be sworn thou art. Thy lips, thy tongue, limbs, actions, and spirits do give thee fivefold blazon. <laughs> Not too fast. Soft. Soft. Unless the master were the man. <laughs> How now? Even so quickly may one catch the plague. Methinks I see this youth's perfection with a subtle and invisible stealth to creep in at mine eyes. Well, let it be. <laughs> what ho, Malvolio? Run after that same peevish man, the county's man. He left this ring behind him. I will none of it. Desire him not to flatter with his lord, nor hold him up with hopes. I am not for him. If that the youth will come this way tomorrow, I'll give him reasons for it. Hi thee, Malvolio. I do I know not what, and seem to find mine eye too great a flatterer for my mind. Fate, show thy force. Ourselves we do not owe. What is decreed must be, and be this so. Thou toldst me when we came from horse, the place was near at hand. Ne'er longed my mother to see me first as I have now. Bassanio, man, where is Posthumus? What's the matter? Why tenderest thou this paper to me with a look untender? My husband's hand. That drug damned Italy hath outcrafted him, and he's at some hard point. My mistress Bassanio hath played the strumpet in my bed. The testimonies whereof lie bleeding in me. I speak not out of weak surmises, but from proof as strong as my grief. And as certain I expect my revenge. That part thou, Pisanio, must act for me, if thy faith be not tainted by the breach of hers. Let thine own hands take away her life. I shall give the opportunity at Milford Haven. false to his bed. What is to be false? To lie there and watch and think on him? To weep twixt clock and clock? If nature charged sleep to break it with a dream of him and cry myself awake, that's false to his bed. I false. Thy conscious witness, Iacomo, thou didst accuse him of incontinency, then thou seemst a villain. Now methinks thy humor is good enough. Some jay of Italy, whose mother was her painting, hath betrayed him. Poor I am stale, a garment out of fashion, and for I am richer than to hang by the walls, I must be ripped. To pieces with me. Oh. oh, men's vows are women's traitors. <laughs>